Good morning. Happy Sunday, everyone. Holy shit, my laptop is actually so dirty. But the first thing I'm gonna do is test the audio, so. Hi, welcome. Now let's check it out. Hi, welcome. The last thing you want is to record a one hour and 30 minute-ish video. <laughs> with the audio from the camera it's so bad i'm j i can't talk about this no oh my god i don't want to put that out there but now i'm like extra paranoid because i said it so i finished everything and i uploaded my video and people are just mean people are fucking mean and i should know this by now but like anytime i have anything that's like i'm not even like but like there's like mean comments and i read them like i want to reply like shit to people because they write mean things but i just know like every time every single time i've ever replied to someone's mean comment it goes over the head it doesn't matter how logical i am it doesn't matter how like good my comeback is because they don't care all they want to do is hurt you so if i would have said something funny like then they'll come back and respond like well i hope you fucking die <laughs> like it literally doesn't matter there's no logic to any of this if they comment something illogical and you correct their logic they're just gonna come back and say something else something completely out of out of the blue to make you hurt because that was the original point of it so there's no point in responding but i want to respond <laughs> this is why i don't read comments like an hour after the video is uploaded because it's just people are gonna be me no matter what and like an audience like mine but k-pop stands they'll never be nice they'll never fucking be nice you see comments and you're like like why did you have to why did you have to comment that i would i reviewed red velvet's feel my rhythm and it's like oh it's noisy like it's very noisy it's very busy people are like you literally stand et's what the fuck okay and like i don't know what you want from me and noisy doesn't mean bad just because i'm not gonna listen to the song doesn't mean that it's a bad song and my friend literally just told me valerie shout out to valerie <laughs> she's like the internet's making people stupid like literally if something isn't handed to you on a platter then people don't fucking understand so yeah that's why i don't respond to hate comments parenthesis anymore because <laughs> i used to oh my god i used to respond to every single comment i used to like every single comment and it was really bad for my mental health like it's not fun i don't care what any influencer or person on social media tells you that it doesn't bother them it does there's no way that it can't because you know isn't it fun to be mean it is fun to be mean i'm literally on tiktok every single day and i find myself getting meaner and meaner like i don't want to be nice like <laughs> I'm just like, what you said is stupid, and you're stupid, and <laughs> it makes, <laughs> literally, the internet, TikTok in particular, is melting my fucking brain. I have no sympathy, so, like, I understand where people are coming from, but at the same time, like, I'm not out here commenting on people's shit. I'll tell it to a friend, or I'll, you know, tell it in my head, because there's a lot of terrible takes on the internet, <laughs> a lot, and a lot of them are stupid as shit. I was just venting. <laughs> waiting in the car no <laughs> my friend sent me a picture of her bubble tea and now i really want bubble tea so let's see what kind of magic we can make i cannot bring you to get bubble tea i know i would love to bring they don't have any drive throughs oh. they don't have any drive throughs misha My toxic trait is that I'm allergic to that bubble tea. Or rather, that bubble tea's toxic trait is that I made my throat so. <laughs> Go! Go, Misha! No, wrong way! What are you doing? <laughs> I find that wrong. I find <laughs> Oh, Jesus. Okay. Oh, shake it first. Shake it first. I'm making my thumbnail for my end of month review and I wanted to show you how I do it. So I'm just looking through these posts from Mnet and I'm just looking for colors that would match each other. So then I make categories. So I have the pink category, purple category, darker blue, lighter blue, this type of blue, 
kind of white, kind of purple, lighter purple. <laughs> and then as soon as I get four in a row of the same color, then we can go with that type of color scheme. You know what I mean? So I got four blue, but I could change the colors to make them more cohesive. I just don't know that I love all of these pictures together. So we're going to try different ones. So now I'm just trying to adjust the purples so that they match better. And what I do is I take this layer and I double it so that then I can go with an eraser and just erase her face. I mean, I'm gonna do a better job, but I'll erase her face so her skin tone wasn't affected, but the background can stay the way I edited it. So now it matches a lot better. And actually I'll show you. That's the difference. Obviously I'll make her face not look like that. <laughs> so now I can show you that's what it's gonna end up looking like. So let me try showing you all the differences. No, no, no. I don't know if you can tell. I just changed the tone a bit. It matches a little better. So then we have this, obviously this guy from Treasure, his background's messing everything a, a bit for me, but I think it looks, it looks all right. It's our attempt number one. We're gonna try different things out. My toxic trait is that I ended up at Sephora. Let me show you what I got. So the first thing I got is this Tatcha, the texture tonic. It said it was new and I ran out of my Biosense sample thing for the resurfacing thing and this resurfaces, so I thought I would try it. Second, I got this. This is the Bump Eraser. Given the fact that I haven't tried this before but saw great reviews, I thought like you know let's just try the small size anyways and then i got the ordinary glycolic acid seven percent toning solution um people say to put this like everywhere except for your face and that it's like really good for so many things like put this instead of deodorant i don't know if that's true don't take my word for it but i want to try it so here we are the question of the day what is your favorite like what's your go-to drink at starbucks what do you usually get Mine looks disgusting right now, but I always get a venti dragon drink. So the mango dragon fruit refresher, I think, uh, but with coconut milk. And I get light ice and no fruit inclusions because I'm pretty sure I'm a, some, it depends on the day. Like sometimes my throat swells up like ever so slightly when it has the inclusions. So I just never get it with inclusions and it always looks sometimes it separates and it looks really gross but like it tastes fine i don't know i think i just like juice i'm probably just it's just juice okay. <laughs> i'm leaving you can you hold down the fort keep your brother warm does the power ever go out and you just you become so stupid because <laughs> the power went out so the tv shut off and i didn't i didn't understand that the power went out at first so i'm like standing there for five minutes trying to turn the tv back on i'm like son of a bitch it's not turning back on and then i figured the power was out i couldn't see lights anywhere <laughs> so then i was like you know what i could actually you know primitive technology i have some dvds i could just watch a dvd since the power is out <laughs> but then i was like well no the power is out dummy not just the internet poles keep catching on fire so i'm taking a nap it's 9 a.m i'm gonna take a nap i there's no reason to be up if there's no internet if there's no what am i supposed to do go outside and touch snow my lovely neighbor offered to take me to Starbucks since the power is out. <laughs> if I don't get my dragon drink, I get a venti. No, I should not get ventis. I get an iced shit. I get an iced white mocha with a vanilla sweet cream foam I saw it on TikTok. No, look what I went and did with it. Oh my god. I am both incredibly upset and sticky right now.